Remember what I was saying? Where I, where I thought the trail went along the mountain and we were gonna go up like that side of that thing? That mountain, the gradual, yeah. Yeah, no, I was wrong. Would you like to see uh, where we're headed? We are headed into that. And I have a feeling the climb is inside that. Oh yeah. Time for a suffer fest. because you know no one's back in here. <laughs> All that water, well, I mean, maybe, but I doubt it. Another thing these side bottle holders on these waste packs are great for is your bear spray. And I'm actually gonna unlatch it because um, I wanna be ready. I actually think more about cougars for some reason. I'm not really concerned about black bears. If I was in grizzly area right now, yes. Oh, there's a sign. All right, we're going up to Elizabeth Lake, so it's two miles. We should be fine. It's a pool. You could just lay here and take a bath. Oh gosh, it's so beautiful. There's nothing like the clean streams, though. They're not murky or anything. And look who's here. Remember from last year? Looking down in the water at these cool rocks. And then I noticed that they move. <laughs> you didn't believe me, did you? There's one there, he's walking. See how beautiful? But see, now I know what it is. It's a caddis fly. Oh, look at you. A little rock crab family member. Just had some snacks. <laughs> I'm so terrible at that. Like I'll just push on and I, I'd be out road biking for eight hours and I would just, it's terrible. I remember my ex used to be like, drink water, drink water. It's more of a fuel thing, right? Like you really should do it. I just. So anyway, I was very good. I almost just started going. I was like, stop and eat some snacks. Have the packet of peanut butter. Get You're gonna do a cl climb, big climb. We wanna get to Martin Lake. That's the intersection. And that's where I'm gonna decide either to take a blue down trap to 21 or get on a black diamond at Martin Lake and go ahead. And it's a shortcut, but it's a black diamond. It's 320 right now. We have five miles to go, and I know we're gonna hit a serious hike a bike. I'm not gonna shoot that much because I just I need to get in a different mindset, and I just need to go because temperature temperatures are gonna change. I'll see you when we hit the intersection at Martin Lake. I know I said I wouldn't see you again. This is no mountain bike trail. This is a cliff. This is insane. I don't know. So chunky and so much rocks. I'm lifting my bike a lot. You know where my mistake is? On the map, it shows a dirt bike. This is all motorcycle. They have little motorcycles here. It means ATV, dirt bike, thought it would be smoother. But this grade, super advanced expert grade for a dirt biker. I can't do this. I'm stopping every five seconds. Since I have a spare big backpack, I'm gonna take my big black sack and put it on my back. Cause then I'm not just pushing all this weight. I have it on my back, half on my back and then half of the bike. But see, I learned, like I don't, I don't have any regrets ever because I just learn, right? Like. I never would have noticed that and thought of that on the map. And now when I look at a map and I see that, I'll, you know, know. Okay, 
I've gone 0.45 and it's taken me 40 minutes. This is the stupidest thing I've ever done. Who the hell built this trail, goats? Oh yay. Might as well just carry my bike over my shoulders for this section. Fuck. So the problem I'm having, I'm losing energy. I can't lift my arms. The tires are sliding. That's how steep it is. I have it with the brake on it. It's sliding. I'm so fucking irritated right now. It's not about will. It's just desire. I can't be annoyed at my choice because I always make these stupid choices and some work out and some don't. Well, I guess I can't be sitting here talking to you guys anymore. Look at this, how high we've come. Holy crap, it's part of the white cloud range. getting emotional. I can feel it. <clears throat> Two hours to go. Two miles. But you know what? And I didn't break anything. I didn't fall off a cliff. Well, I did, but I caught myself. You've got to be kidding me. Oh my god. Oh no. Now you see, when I fuck up, when I make a bad choice, I make sure it's a big mountain. Yeah. So there's Mary's Lake. Hmm. I haven't been by one stream, nothing. I carried my water up most of the hill. I usually do that because I'm always afraid I'm not going to see water again because sometimes it can show it on a map, but it could be dried up. Well, I don't want to walk all the way down there for water because it could, it could just get really gnarly. I have no idea. I'm not gonna stay up here. I don't know. We should be staying at 8200 now and then kind of going down. So the trail comes up here. And, oh shit, really? It takes a lot of strength also to go down. Wow, this is what I was pushing up. See, I mean, this just goes d straight down. And in my exhaustion, it's called Elizabeth Lake, not Mary. I know funny my brain because I'm dyslexic, so it's like a lot. Sometimes people are called Beth. <laughs> yeah, they're not called Mary from Elizabeth, are they? I just rode my bike, but down a bunch of that. It was, I, it's amazing. My bike's not like broken. Look at this. I saw that white reflection of the bark in there, and then I'm like, wait a minute, is that water? This is Kelly Lake. <sighs> this is that stuff you step on and your foot sinks. Oh, I wanted to jump in. I wonder if it's like this all the way around. Let me walk along here just a little bit and see. Hey, guess what? We're done. I can't believe that this wasn't rated double black. That was a triple black. Let me just go a little bit further. Let's see. Oh, how beautiful. It's a little Loch Ness monster. <laughs> I just walked down to the end of the lake, just curious what other camp spots there are because, I mean, you know, I am completely depleted, but hey, you know, you have to have the perfect camp spot. There's nothing. This It turns into like this, this murk, and that's it. So the camp spot that we have is the camp spot. How... Perfect did this work out. See? And these are the bedrooms, right? And then we have the living room, or you could say the kitchen, because this is where people probably cook. It's nice. And then you have a little walk down to the water. Dang, look at these two trees. Wow, they came down. 
I'm going to get my little pot out and we're going to have a yummy dinner. Can someone please set my tent up for me? Oh, it made me so happy and fetch water from that creek because I have to walk back there now and get some. But I'll put the tent up first because it's like seven. Oh good, I look exactly how I feel. <laughs> Actually, I probably look like this often, all disheveled. We are up in the mountains right now. There's a lot of animal trails all around here. I've made a lot of stupid choices on this trip. Well, in like the last four days. All these hike -a bikes my gosh, why didn't I bail? I think it's because the, the field was a grind. I, like you didn't see, you weren't there for the whole thing. <laughs> but it was a grind, even though it was kind of fun and refreshing to go back through that. And then I still then had to get onto single track. I just thought there would be more breaks. That's, that's honestly, I just did not expect it to be straight up for the whole thing. It's beyond expert. It's like evil Knievel. <laughs> But don't worry, we're never gonna do that again. This is the most beautiful trail ever. Remember at the beginning when we were in that field, the dry field and the dirt bikers went by us. And then we were at sort of some single track going through, it was pretty. I still had to hike a bike, but it was manageable. And then we went by that lake, that, that huge swimming pool. And then we went into that magnificent elk meadow. It was stunning views. It was incredible what we did. We'd already had some exertion. Can't wait to watch the footage because I'm just in another zone and I'm not paying attention to what I'm saying. I know I swore a lot more than I recorded. It was a very bipolar day. <laughs> I'll be curious what part of my body hurts in the morning. In all the years and all the hikes I've done, all the bikes, all the grueling, like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. Let this be over. This was the hardest one. I'm gonna go rinse some stuff and and then I'm gonna curl up and hopefully daze into a beautiful sleep. It'd be great to see a bear on the other side getting a drink. I feel we're gonna be visited by a bear this evening. I don't know why, I just do. So I have the rainfly unzipped lower, and I have my bear spray next to me. I have my headlamp ready to go so I can shine it on him and take video of him breaking into my bike stuff. <laughs> 